Hey guys, I hope you're all well. I wanted to film a video today about items that have really made getting ready um, for me in the morning a lot easier. And these are just a couple of the items. I mean, it's kind of just like a little flavor of something that I'm enjoying to talk about and evolving my style. It's kind of a journey, it's a process. Um, since the beginning of time, I think my values are very different when it comes to my wardrobe, when it comes to life. Um, I think we all live and learn. So um, a lot has changed in my evolution of style, the things I like, the aesthetics that I'm more drawn towards. So the idea of having a few items in your wardrobe that you can just gravitate to, um, take out the thinking of getting dressed in the morning. It can be really exhausting when you are in a rush, trying to try on so many different outfits just to look good, to feel good. But by the time you've already tried your like fourth or fifth pair of jeans or your fourth or fifth top, you're kind of exhausted, you don't really care. And then you just grab the same thing that you usually wear because you know it kind of worked the other day. So guess what? You're just gonna rewear the same thing. Um, there's two things wrong with that. The first is it's so damn stressful. And secondly, you buy all these beautiful pieces thinking that you're gonna style them in a really unique way, but all that ends up happening is that you never wear them, they stay on the hangers and you just keep wearing and wearing and wearing the pieces that you're more familiar with. I've only picked three pieces, just to keep it a short and sweet video. I'm not sure about whether you prefer a long form, short form, so I've kind of met, it, met in the middle um, by picking the three pieces. Now, I know that I gravitate towards the same easy, comfortable, breezy pieces um, over and over again. So I decided to build on that. And what I'm trying to say is if I know that I really like wearing big baggy sweatshirts and leggings, and that's something that fits in with the lifestyle that I'm currently living, I'm going to make sure that the big baggy sweatshirt and leggings that I'm actually wearing flatter me, uh, make me feel as confident as they can, flatter my body shape, um, and also go with a plethora of other things because there's nothing worse than having one item that only goes with one pair of jeans which only goes with one pair of shoes. First thing that I live in is loungewear and I would love to be the girl that lounges in cashmere loungewear but um, I have a slightly messier lifestyle and I can't be doing hand washing and really worrying about the way I'm washing my items. I will get food on it, I'll get spaghetti on it, I'll get snot on it. I mean, it's not ideal. So this item has really served me so well and it is a sweatshirt, but it looks like denim. Um, so it kind of elevates my loungewear game and <laughs> I can literally put this over anything and look presentable enough to walk out the door. So I have to be really honest with you guys, this is probably my everyday outfit combination. It's literally just a pair of leggings and a long sleeve t-shirt. Now, that's the reason I need some pieces that are gonna elevate this look. So I'm gonna just put on a sweatshirt I was talking about. I feel like any half zip or half button sweatshirt like this could work um, just like that it just adds warmth comfort a little bit of that kind of chilled edgy vibe I mean if you want to go ahead and put on a hat or a cap you can do that um, maybe something like this you also just put on a pair of Ugg boots um, or a pair of trainers. You can add a posh bag, make it a little bit more elevated. You can add a crossbody bag. For something a little bit more casual. You can add a pair of Chelsea boots. This is the look, guys. It's just that easy. Or a pair of Ugg boots, a pair of loafers. I mean, you get the idea. 
It's just so versatile. It goes with absolutely everything. It's comfortable, it's easy. My piece number one. Next item um, that I wanna talk about is something that again has really changed the way I wear my everyday basic pieces and it's literally the smallest smallest thing but it just changes the flavor of how my outfit's going so it doesn't feel too repetitive and that is this skirt. I find that it does cinch me in at the waist and it also has a really pretty flare which is very delicate fabric so I wear this with a heavier knit, with a lighter knit, with a cardigan, with a, maybe a, a shirt tucked in and a blazer. I just feel like it's one of the most versatile pieces um, in my wardrobe and this is actually a skirt from Arquette. You can wear it with a blouse, you can wear it with tights, you can wear it with boots, you can wear it flat. I mean it's a real workhorse in my cupboard. But this is the second outfit with this skirt. So it's literally a really stretchy comfortable skirt I'm wearing a cashmere sweater on top and a coat and some boots obviously you can wear tights um, you can wear a baggier sweater you can wear a baggy sweater and a scarf um, you can wear Chelsea boots literally it is endless possibilities I like to store my accessories in a particular way, especially on the days where I don't really feel like experimenting with my outfit, I just want to get out the door and look good um, at the same time. I store it all together. So the idea is that you have a belt that you wear on a regular basis, a pair of shoes or loafers or whatever it is that you wear on a regular basis, and any kind of bag that you wear on a regular basis. Anything that you put in between those items are just gonna go because your accessories have pulled it together. So say for example, I'm wearing a burgundy sweater and a pair of straight leg jeans and all I have to do then is put on my bag, belt and shoe combination and the outfit just works. I've just paired it with a waistcoat the same t-shirt I was wearing with my lounge set, the belt, the shoes and the bag, anything else in between, you can mix and match and it can still look put together. Bear in mind a lot of my outfits are neutrals. If you do like colour, by the way, um, print out the colour wheel, stick it on the wall, have a look at what's opposite each other, have a look at the three that are next to each other, play around a little bit, play around with your skin tone, your undertones. It's all just fun. So I'm gonna leave it there. If you have that time in the morning, it's great to be able to experiment with a statement piece, something you've not worn for a while, etc., etc. But this is for just getting dressed and looking good and getting out of the door. Let me know if you'd like to see more style content. As always, thank you so very much for watching. A really, really good rest of your day. Bye.